in the in, in future as as five, ten, fifteen years ahead, I, I would love to see that we are really making making an impact where the people that we support we are gonna be in sync with them, that all the ideas that we thought we had when this whole thing started, they will appreciate it and they will in turn take it forward to affect our generation or to affect our continent. There's so much bad stuff, there's so much bad um, reputation about Africa and we, we would like we would love to change that. Well, our mission has been to change how things work in Africa. Um, what, we, what we consider utmost is not what selfless, Africa, what selfless for Africa will be in the next 10 years or the next 100 years. What we are concerned about is what the, what the conversation and how Africa will be in the next 50 years. And our hope is for people to look at what we are doing and to emulate what we are doing, not just by joining us, by setting up their own ideas and <coughs> programs to try to change this culture in Africa. We have the future generation are given an opportunity to decide their own fate and do things well like the rest of the world. Um, I see S4A branching out to helping or partnering with orphanages, helping in the hospitals, maybe people afflicted with like AIDS, which is very rampant in Africa. I also see us possibly helping the people that are trying to start their own businesses, like small businesses, maybe giving out loans to them and um, obviously also doing more drives, not just clothing drives, maybe book drives or other drives that will help schools back home in Africa as well and also orphanages and anybody in the general community, wherever there is a need, I would like S4A to be able to fulfill it with our growing resources and manpower. Hopefully, um I guess getting bigger, but also in the expansion, but uh, staying true to the original intention, which was to propel selflessness in everybody that we come in contact with through this organization. So it would be great to look back and see thousands upon thousands of people that we've helped with the organization, but that this same objective is still the same, that they are actually being selfless and they are better members of society because of the vision that we still live in. Hmm. I always prefer to look in the long term because uh, what is it, the typical saying the journey of a thousand the, the journey of a thousand miles begins with one step so rather than focus on three years I like to look at where I would be over a lifetime and over a lifetime I would like for us to make an imprint on the world based on the efforts that we've put into Selfless for Africa. It is, I cannot at this point sit here and say these are the things we can do to make an imprint. But one thing I believe we can do is to continuously make efforts to change lives and to change the mindset that's prevailing in Africa about just acquiring wealth and making money and start thinking about giving back and imprint that in people's minds.